triple play module for our 2015 Fat Boy Low. We've already installed our LED turn signal clusters and our LED tail light. So we're going to add the run brake turn function to the rear turn signals along with the strobe or flash patterns. Let's get started by checking the function of the bike. We've got running light, brake light, left turn, right turn. Once we can confirm those functions are working, we'll get installed and started on the install for the module. Once you have the seat removed, you want to locate the main harness that goes to the rear of the bike. It's located on the right hand side of the motorcycle. It's an 8 pin plug. There's a release tab. You'll push that down and unplug the harness. You'll get your triple play module, open it up, save the instructions step by step on how to do the programming feature. You want to plug the module in, make sure it clicks. Make sure it clicks. You want to make sure all the dial and the switches are set for program mode. So the dial to zero switches in the off position. Switches are going to be to the bottom of the case. Switch one is on the outside. Switch two is next to the dial. So once you have that plugged in, you want to turn the bike on. You've got 30 seconds to put it in program mode. Start with switch two, on, off, on. Switch one, on, off, on. The rear turn signals will now fade up and down. Once they stop fading up and down, you can now put the uh, running lights for the turn signals to match the brightness of the tail light. If you have all LEDs, usually settings two or three, you're close. Once you're satisfied with that, and that's the correct brightness, and you're trying to match the running light of the turn signals to the running light of the tail light. So that looks like a pretty good match. We'll grab the brake and that's going to lock that in. Now, a couple neat features. You have 10 different strobe or flash patterns to choose from. One of our most popular is our Blaster X pattern, pattern number 6. And that'll strobe for about 7 seconds and then go solid. Once you're satisfied with that, again, test operation. Right turn signal, left turn signal, and again, brake. Another safety feature we have is if you're braking, see how the turn signals are strobing, and you turn on the turn signal, the strobe function stops on the turn signals. As long as the turn signal is on, the turn signals will not strobe, and that will keep you from confusing the riders or drivers behind you. Once you're satisfied with that, we'll need to double check and make sure there's no trouble codes on the bike. Once everything's operating, you want to find a good secure place to mount the triple play box, install the seat, and you're ready to ride. Behind the battery is good. Once you uh, have the module secured and out of the way, you can reinstall the seat and you're ready to ride. It's a great addition to your LED turn signals and your LED tail light. It's a great safety feature, easy install. Um, you can give us a call or online at www.customdynamics.com.